take three. Okay. <laughs> Ascending aorta. Mm -hmm. Aortic arch. Descending aorta. Pulmonary trunk. Pulmonary arteries. Your, this is your right coronary artery. Right here. The right marginal artery runs along the side, so you can see it right there. And the posterior interventricular artery runs back around here, and you can see it on the underside, right under here, right under there. Posterior interventricular artery. This is your left coronary artery. This is your anterior interventricular artery. Do I have to open it to see one of them? Well, this is circumflex right here. Yeah, this one, the left coronary artery. Oh, yeah, okay, yeah. Because you can just see a little branch, left yeah. coronary. And then uh, this is circumflex artery. All right. Your brachiocephalic trunk is here. This right here would be your right common carotid artery. This would be your right subclavian artery branch off the arch of the aorta. The aorta. This is your left common carotid artery and your left subclavian artery, which branch off the aortic arch. Superior vena cava is here. Inferior vena cava down here. Inferior vena cava. Your great cardiac vein is right here. Great cardiac vein. It runs with what artery? It runs with the anterior interventricular artery. Mm -hmm. The middle cardiac vein is right under here. It runs along with the posterior interventricular artery. Your small cardiac vein, which is this little guy, runs along your right marginal artery. The coronary sinus, which you can't really see on this model very well, is right in this region behind these. You can't see it at all. Yeah, you can't really see it at all. Uh, your brachiocephalic veins is this guy here and this guy here. They come together to form the superior vena cava. And the posterior, or I'm sorry, the pulmonary veins, you have four or five of them posterior on the heart, which are right here. Pulmonary veins.